All right, hello everyone, and peace of Christ to all of you. Um, we are live on air too early today uh, because we have a Muslim who claimed that he want to debate me, but I blocked him. I mean, you believe it? I mean, how horrible a Christian prince! How you block the Abdul? How dare you? So you know, I wanted to get him busted. So I said, okay, you know what? I want to see if this is true or not. I want you to show us if I blocked you or not. You know what? I'm going even to go live on air just for the sake of you. <laughs> My Skype is open. And we ask him to come and call me in Skype immediately. I don't care how many people are listening. I do not need to prepare for a debate. I want to see how big are you, the guy who said this. Look, read with me carefully what he said. Uh, his name is Asana uh, Bodha I have approached Christian Prince on YouTube and Debate TV. He seems to be selecting people that they are not a challenge. He blocked me before because he know he is no expert. Please come out of hiding for what what respectable debate. One of your followers really want to see this. His name Joe Hudek. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for the sake of Joe Hedek, I don't know who's that. You are giving me headache with. I want you to call me right now, you coward. I want you to call me right now, you coward. And look, I said to him, you are a big fat liar. Huh? Show us where the text you are being blocked. Stop playing and I will, you know what, shall I go right now on air? Look what he says to me. Can you please exp even explain why you have a habit of speaking full language? Uh, your follower repeat the behavior. He, he, now he changed the topic. What full language? Did I say the F word like your prophet? Call me. Call me, potato. You are a coward. You are a coward. I'm waiting for you. You are a liar. Nobody blocked you. You are no one. You want to show people that you are a person who knows you know what i want to see what do you know call me my skype is open you said that you don't have a skype i mean have you ever heard a guy when i call me from india you can afford to pay for a phone caller from india but you cannot call me in skype for free do you think really i will give you a phone number i never give a phone number to anyone if i have one now call me in Skype. Be a man. I'm waiting for you. If you don't call me, everybody will, will, will be dying, laughing at your lies, saying we blocked you and we are hiding from you. I want to know who are you. Who are you to the point Christian Prince is hiding from you? I mean, you must be an amazing scholar. I want to learn from you. Can we have your majesty calling me right now? Please. Should, shall we beg you? Please. Please, for the sake of Allah. Please do something. Call us. I mean, come on. What's his name? His name is Joe Hudek is asking you, let us make it happen, my friend. Let us finally make it happen. Please. How many times I need to say please for you so you will make it happen? Hmm? This potato, he thought to himself, it is 3 a.m. in the morning in Christian Prince time. So I'm going to pause this and have a run. He never thought I am there. He never thought I'm going to go live on air immediately. Just for his sake. You know what I mean? He never thought this would happen. He said, there is no way this guy is going to open his life on air at 3 a.m. in the morning. This guy must be crazy to do so. <laughs> well, I'm a crazy, my friend. I'm a crazy like the prophet. I imagine things happening. So let us imagine that you are calling me now. Can you make it happen? I am the same as your prophet. I imagine myself having sex, but in fact, I did not. Now, can you make me have that feeling your prophet used to feel? Hmm? Coward? I'm waiting. I mean, you see, guys, they challenge, they want to debate. They want to debate us, but they cannot find Christian Prince. Christian Prince, he blocked us. Blocked you where? I don't even block people on YouTube. I have admins there, they are watching the text. 
to say we blocked you that's mean <laughs> you want to call me but you cannot but you just said you never have a skype you just said you never die. you don't have a skype so what do you what do you mean you are trying to debate me but you don't want to call me you want to debate me in text are you a potato you grow a beard and you want to show some muslims that you have a beard and you are a hero want to debate christian prince you want to take a snapshot i was challenging christian prince is that what you are trying to do you want to take a selfie with it don't you this guy he want to make a he want to make selfie guys he he will take a, 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 a selfie of himself next to his comment saying i have approached christian prince on youtube and debate tv what do you mean in debate tv what does that mean what does that mean guys he approached me in youtube and debate tv what does that mean what, what debate tv do you have a debate tv somebody told you i have a tv it's called debate tv what does that what does that mean exactly he seems to be selecting people they are not challenged and he blocked me before because he know he is not expert please come out of your hiding brother <laughs> guys i have two blankets on me i have to hide i mean what i can do we have to hide this guy is a scary you know just you know i mean yesterday a few hours ago i was on air on air for how many hours and i keep saying who is a muslim want to call us who is a muslim would like to call us and now you are saying every day we go on air we say who is a muslim want to call us who for the sake of allah want to call us and nobody called and now you liar you claim that we blocked you it's a shame those people have no shame it's amazing how they lie and they fabricate lies and they think they can get away with it well not with the christian prince here we go i'm waiting for you i will wait for the coming 15 minutes if you don't call everybody will laugh at you everybody will go to, to 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 facebook and will make fun of you for the rest of your life making a false challenge is a very coward act look guys <laughs> look what he posted <laughs> the, the coward look what he posted christian prince nice move you are playing games i will make a video to you and you can do this online right now but that what you do play games you keep saying call without any number you stupid idiot i never give a number for anyone this is my skype <laughs> you don't give me number do you think even if i have a number i will give it to someone a muslim in the internet do you think really i mean look this you see how they lie you want to call a number from india but you don't have a skype have you ever heard of an indian guy in india don't have a skype and why you don't want to skype to use a skype are you anti-skype is is is, you, is a skype against your religion <laughs> it's not halal the phone number is made the phone made by the by the by the wisdom by the kuffar and skype is made by the kuffar so why you are not going to call me call good Yeah, potato. Anyway, look like he is not going to call. He's just a kid. Oh boy, you believe it? It's three three eighteen in the morning. I mean, come on, come on, Abdul. But this this potato, he never thought I will. I'm going to. <laughs> I never thought I will go on there. <laughs> He said to himself, "I can, I can say, I can make a claim. I can take a, I, I will, I will, uh, I will post a challenge for him, and I will post a snapshot in my, you know, Facebook page, and I will tell everybody that I challenged Christian Prince, and Christian Prince is running away from me. Yeah, mm. true story. I mean, I believe you, and every now, everybody believe you." And what is the excuse for you? You will not call. Nobody knows. 
why you want a phone number you covered if I give you a phone number you promise to call do you promise to call in a phone number <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> I love the Abdul's. They are my favorite. Seriously, I love them. You know, they are very smart, very intelligent, and very brave. And guys, Christian Prince always he challenged the one who is not a challenge. Like supposedly this guy he eat too much vitamin and he is the hero. You know, like he is the one who will do I mean he, he will do what no Muslim was able to do. This is the guy. So he posed a challenge to Christian Prince and then he will show it to the Muslims. He will say to the Muslims, did you see? Hey Fatima, did you see sister? What, what brother, what? Uh, sister, do you have a Skype? We can talk in camera. I will explain to you what I did to Christian Prince. Uh, but the brother, as I know, you told the Christian Prince that you didn't have a Skype. Oh, so you know about it. No, I download the Skype. I download it now. <laughs> Wake up, Abdul. Wake up. Next time when you challenge Christian Prince, you better be ready for that. What a potato you are. You thought you can get away with it? You post a challenge, Christian Prince block you. How I can block you, you idiot? What do you mean block you? I'm asking you to call. And you just said you never have a Skype. People, they call me live. People don't debate me in text. I don't debate people in text. Since when I debate people in text, call me. Call me and Allah will grant you a lot of versions. Don't you want to get versions? Or you are the same kind and quality of your prophet. You cannot do it in the bed. This is why you don't want to. <laughs> anyway, guys, sorry for me. Uh, did I wake you up, guys? Who of you was asleep? Give me one. No, I don't. I don't sleep. I'm the nightmare of Allah. Allah will not be even asleep because of me. <laughs> oh boy, yeah. But you know, this is what they do. I remember once it was uh, the Muslim. He came and he said, "I want to debate you in December 25th." I mean, have you ever heard in the world somebody trying somebody to debate in uh, December 25th in in the in the in the Christmas day? But he thought. He thought I would say no. Is my voice coming, guys? Is my voice coming? Do you hear me? So anyway, they challenged me in December 25th. They said no, he will say no. And then we will record it. And they will say, we see, we challenge Christian Prince. And he did not, he said he cannot do it. You know? But the surprise surprise don't say that to christian prince i said sure why not <laughs> christmas day it's a wonderful day let us do it on christmas day the coward did not show up <laughs> oh <boy. laughs> uh, christmas day huh what about we do it you know what about we do it when uh, uh in my funeral funeral day what what do you what do you think if we make a debate in my funeral day you muslims agree I think this is the only day you Muslims will, will, will come to the debate. <laughs> once once I was debating Abdul, and it was really good. I mean, this guy, he was, whew, as usual. So he said, I have to go to the bathroom, please. Guys, this was almost 10 years ago. Since then, he never come back. And I'm really worried about him. I wanted to report the police, like, I mean, to look for him. Maybe he fell down in the, you know, I mean, 10 years. Since then, he never come back. I mean, what kind of a bathroom that bathroom is? That people, they go in and they go missing. Since then, he never come back. That's why you have to be careful, my friend. I think the genie did something to him. Because the prophet, he says, if you enter the bathroom with certain foot and you don't say the prayer, genies, they do something to you. All right. So I look like he is not going to call the idiot. He made me go on air. I mean, you believe it? It's not his fault. It's my fault. But just I wanted to get him busted. I know he will not call. I know he is not going to come. Uh, so how is everybody? Everybody is fine? Everybody is fine? Are you sure? Okay. Uh, okay. 
let me change the picture here. I mean, this guy, I mean, enough of Abdul. We don't want more. Let us see something more, uh, something beautiful. What this guy is snowing there, what he is doing there in my screen. Let us see something nice. Let us see some versions, maybe. You know, and maybe then we get some Muslims want to call us. You know. <clears throat> let us see, let us see. Uh Lord have mercy on the stupidity of people. You see, I, I search, I search for something hot. I mean, look how lucky Christian Prince is. Guys, you will not believe it. I wanted to show you some versions, right? So what I did, I went to this uh, website. The one is, you know, give you a, a free pictures, royalty free. And I searched for hot. And guess what? This is how lucky I am. Look what I got when I... I mean, even when I look for something hot, look what I get. Look at this. Unbelievable. <laughs> I mean, I mean, life is not fair. <laughs> oh, boy. oh, that's hot. That's seriously hot. <laughs> See, if you are a Christian prince, what happened to you, my friend? Don't ever look for a heart if your name start with a Christian and end with a prince. This is your luck. And you are asking me why you are not married. I mean, look at this. I mean, look at this. Even in the internet, I'm not getting it. I mean, even I'm unbelievable. I have to convert to Islam. If, 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 if <laughs> you have this at home, <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> even that I don't have at home, you believe it? Even this I don't have at home. He have it at home. <laughs> oh boy uh, <clears throat> I mean we look for something hot look what we get this this is this is not not right <coughs> let us see something else hot oh no this is too much <laughs> oh boy oh lord okay okay anyway you know i just wanted to get this guy busted and the coward he is not showing and he is not even posting anymore uh any any muslim he have the courage any muslim he feel he think he can call us feel free anytime we give you a chance to talk to us once and twice and three and four and five and seven and if you start using a bad language then we stop talking to you as simple as that or if we are done with you, let us say you've been cooked and you've been served, which means already you've been used too much. There's nothing, there's no more mayonnaise can come out of you, then I will stop talking to you. All right, this is the only way. Can I buy your book personal, personally, CV? Just asking. I don't know how you can buy my book personally. You want to come and see me to buy the book? I mean, this would cost you a lot of money. Go and buy the book from Amazon. All right, and I don't have books. I don't have my books actually. It's Amazon who sell my books, and they have my books. I don't. I don't have my books. I don't even have a copy. Uh, <clears throat> I send. Uh, I send two copies, German copies, to Germany. Took it two months, and then come back. You believe it? <laughs> oh boy. Hey, Jamir, how are you, my friend? Jamir, are you going to leave Islam soon? Did you decide to leave Islam soon? You are just new here listening to us, but I'm sure you will leave Islam very soon if you did not leave Islam yet. But listen, my friend, if you leave Islam, I'm warning you, you will not get versions. There is no religion supply versions except the religion of Muhammad. This is the only religion who come with this such, such a supplement. Even Las Vegas cannot give you what Muhammad can give. I'm warning you. I mean, you will lose all the versions. <laughs> By the way, those versions are not versions, they are already used. But Allah, He will make them version and version again, which means it's cheating. It's like Chinese product. It says version again, but it's not really. I don't know what to say. <clears throat> Do we have any Abdul would like to call me? I am, as long as I am on air, and I am on air. I mean, anyone want to call me? And you guys, while you are awake, what's wrong with you? Christian prince don't sleep because he cannot find something hot. You guys, you cannot sleep, why? Let us see who is calling. I hope it's him. Hello? 
Hello. Hello. Oh, yes, it's me, brother. And yeah, I found out how to get. Can you hear me? Yes. Uh, who are you, uh, sir? This is this is a son of Bolatara. Oh, okay. You are the one who want to debate me. Yeah. Oh, yes. All right. That's I, wonderful. I, I, I do appreciate the fact that you did uh, let me know about uh, the Skype. Can you uh, can you mute please the the YouTube? Can you mute it? Because the voice is coming twice. Okay. All right. Can you hear me? All right. I hear you. Go ahead. Okay. So, um, like I said, you were on um, some kind of channel before. It was like they had a uh, some other religious type of forum, and I did try to debate you then, and you did block me. So I didn't make that I, up. I don't remember you, my friend. Anyway, you said you never have a Skype. I never gave a phone number. Anyway, I mean. How I can block no, you? No, no, no. I didn't understand. I, I, I agree with you. I didn't understand how the Skype worked, but once I downloaded, no problem. Skype Let us go to business. Let us not to waste our okay, time. Okay. 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 Go okay. ahead. What so do you want to say to first, me? First, before we can say anything, <laughs> I want you to tell me: um, Have you ever actually read the entire Bible? My friend, I am not educated like you. I am here to debate you. I'm not here to be investigated about what I did read. No, 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 no. I'm no. not trying. To, you said trying you you said you said something about me that I am trying to pick up people who they are not to challenge, right? Is that yes, correct? It, okay. Yeah, I, I now, totally are you are you a Muslim? Yes, I am a Muslim. Okay. Let me. Let me, well, let me you asked me a question. You asked me a question before we start. You said to me, "Are you um, Catholic, whatever?" Right. 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 Okay. What kind of Muslim you are? I'm. I'm a Muslim. What, is, what does that there's mean? No, what does that mean? No, I don't believe in any separate divisions of but, Islam. But you're, you're a Muslim or you're not a Muslim. Okay, but this is not what your prophet said. That's not what my prophet said. My, my okay, prophet let me show you what your prophet said. Okay, hold on. Let me show you what your prophet said. Let me show you what your prophet said. No, 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 no. No, 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 one second. Because you asked me a question, right? right. You asked me. Yeah, I'm right? asking you, so but at the same time you gave me a wrong answer. You did not give me the answer. There's nothing. Nothing is called. I am just a Muslim. The Quran says, let do not divide into sex, right? It tells you do the, not the Quran divide says that into sex. the Quran the says Quran that. Does say, yeah, of course, you know that. Uh, okay, well. no, I do you not know. know. I want to learn from you. The Quran says don't divide yourself into sex, okay? Right? So, so therefore, <laughs> if you're if, if anybody has read and studied the Quran, there, hmm. there should be no sectarianism, right? Now, at the same so you time, don't believe in the hadith? Is, Let me make it simple. Do you believe in the hadith or no? I believe the hadith is useful, but it's not essential. Is it the Quran, you, is it either you say you believe in it or you don't believe listen, it? Listen, so do you believe in it or no? Listen, listen. We can we can know this for sure, right? The Quran is mm. the, the Muslims believe that the Quran was sent down by Allah, right? Mm. The hadith wasn't sent down by Allah, mm. right? It's written by men. It's the sayings. Mm. The sayings, people saying stuff. It's like uh mm. people saying, I heard this, I heard that, mm. whatever. The but same, the not, same not, as the, the not, same as the Quran. The Quran no, is. No, I heard no, this. No, I heard no, this. No, no, no. Don't okay. O that. Open your Quran. Open your Quran. No, no, open your Quran. Quran. No, no. You see, we are we are talking. We are not see, just see, jumping see, over see, topic. No, we don't want to jump. We don't want to jump. When you say something, you have to prove it. When you say something, listen, listen. When you talk to me, when you say something, you have to prove it. You cannot jump over it. You said the Quran is not the same as the Hadith. I want you to open the Quran and tell me in the first page it says this Quran is according to who? Can you read that for me, sir? Can you read that for me? According to who? Listen the Quran to you have in your hand is according to who? No, the Quran you have in your hand. We will no, continue. No, we are continuing. We don't, continue. we don't want to jump. We don't want to jump. My, my friend, my friend, listen, you are an adult. You are not a kid. You mention something. You have to prove it. Otherwise, either you are into calling me to prove me wrong. Aren't you calling me to prove me wrong? Listen, listen. Are you calling me to prove me wrong or to prove me right? Are you calling me to prove me wrong or to prove me right? You are calling me to prove me right, wrong, correct? I say to you, you are wrong right now, and I challenge you to prove me wrong. The Quran is according to the same as the Hadith. Open your open your Quran. Open your Quran and and read for me. So why you are lying? So why why you are trying? Why you are trying to jump over it? Listen, listen. Because I got you busted from the beginning, right? We did not start yet, and you got busted. You are lying. You are lying. Why you are saying the Quran is not according to? Why you are? Why why? Listen, 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 listen. You cannot play games with me. You cannot play games with me. The Quran you have in your hand is according to who? Is according to who? Sir. Don't serve me. I'm asking you a question. Let us no, debate. The Quran you have in your hand is according to who? 
according to who? Fear stuff that you do my friend, time. my friend, why you don't want to answer? Is according to who? You something directly. Why you don't want to answer? Why you don't Let want to answer? No, I'm Let asking you. I'm asking you. You are. You mentioned something. Me you mentioned something false. The Quran you're, you're you have. Afraid. You're very afraid, sir. Listen, very listen, listen. This is listen. yeah. I can tell who's afraid. You are the one who's afraid to answer the question. Very simple question. Sir, the I'm Quran the one is according. The Quran is according to who? You are. You are. Listen, listen, listen. I am saying loud and clear, open in front of everybody. You are a liar. The Quran you said is not according to who? I'm asking you now. The Quran in the front of you. Who is making an assertion in the Quran? Does the Quran assert it comes from Allah? <laughs> yes. Does the Hadith assert that it comes from Allah? No. So you know that. Really? You can't play that game. No, I can. can't. I, I can't. I can't game. play that game because the Quran says game. that this is a Hadith. Is it the Quran? Is the it? Isn't it the Quran? Is a Hadith too? Is not it the Quran? Listen, listen, listen. Don't talk don't too much. Don't talk too much. Is it the Quran? Is a Hadith? Yes or no? The Hadith. Is never asserted to come from Allah. is the Quran is a hadith too. Is this is not a question? The Quran is the Quran is a hadith. The Quran is not a hadith. You are you sure? Um, are you are sure? Not, you want to challenge? You want to challenge? You want to challenge me? You want to challenge me, sir? Do you want to no, challenge me? No, you're trying to you're trying to guide me away from what I was saying. No, no, no. The Quran is a hadith. I want to show everybody. I want to show everybody. Listen, listen. You don't know your Quran. You just stayed a lie. The Quran no, is a hadith. You just told me that you were not educated in the Bible. I'm not educated about anything because okay. Muslims are the best to know about everything. Okay. okay. Listen, wait, listen, wait, wait. listen, so, listen. Don't jump. So, don't jump. So, don't jump. So, don't so, not, jump. You are a, you are a, you are a coward. No, listen, the, listen, 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 no, listen. The Quran says the Quran says that the Quran is the we best of the Hadith. The Quran, the Quran, so shut up, shut question. up. We cannot talk in the same time. You are a coward, you don't want to answer. The Quran so says that Allah, right. Allah, right. He sent the best of the hadith as a book. You are a coward, you don't want to answer, right? Why you lie to us? Why you lie? You said to us the Quran is not according to why you lie. You say the Quran is not a hadith. The Quran in front of you, it says Allah who nizla ahsan al hadith kitab. Do you understand what I said? Sir, do you understand what I said? Do you understand what I said? I'm sure you don't understand Arabic. Do you do you know Arabic? Do you know Arabic? Do you know Arabic? Okay, then answer me. Allahu nizzala ahsan al hadithi kitaban. What does that mean? Allahu nizzala ahsan al hadithi kitaban. What does that mean? What does that mean? No. What does that mean? You are a coward. You don't want to answer. So now you you are lying about the Quran. You are lying about the Quran. Already we started. You said that I am a Muslim. You said I'm a Muslim. Your prophet said, "Listen, potato. Listen, listen. I'm. We are doing it right now. I'm spanking you. I'm spanking you. I'm spanking you. You are a coward. So why you call me? Why you call me? Why you call me? Why, if you will not answer anything, why you call me? If you are, if you are not going to answer, why you call me? Sir, sir. Don't sir me. I'm asking you. Why you call me? If you will not answer anything. Why? Because you don't want people to hear me talk. Why you don't want to answer? And why you are calling me if you will not answer? For the person that you just admitted that you were uneducated. Same as Muhammad. I am uneducated. Listen. 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 Why you call me? Why you call me if you won't answer anything? Is that how we debate? Is that how we debate? You won't answer anything? Is that the debate? Okay. I call you to debate me. I call you to call me. I told you to call me to debate me. Until now, you refuse to answer anything I said to you. No, I'm asking you. Okay, let's start from zero. Hold on. One, two, three. We start again. We start again. The Quran is according to who? The Quran in your hand is according to who? I'm listening. Let's start from zero, but you won't let me start. No, uh, we start from zero. Here we go. I ask you a question. The Quran you have in your hand is according to who? I want the answer. You are jumping. You are not going to answer. I know you already. I know you. You are a coward. You will not answer. Let us start from zero. Listen. A lot of trash talking because you didn't think I was gonna call, but I I did download. Skype. You did not call yet. You did not call. You are not answering anything. You are a coward. Did you call? Did you call? You did not call. You did not call. What is wrong with you? You did not call. Otherwise, answer. The Quran you have in your hand is according to who? Answer. Dude, the Quran is a recital. Gabriel. According to who? You are a liar. You are a liar. This is what. This is not what the Quran is saying. This is not what the Quran is saying. Open the Quran for me and tell me what is written in page number A. 
page number A, what it says. Do you want me to show it to you? What page number A is saying? Sir. Do you want to take a snapshot? Do you want to take a you're, picture? You're, 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 so everybody will laugh at you? All you're trying to do is keep talking. Answer. Uh, no, no, I'm here. I'm here to spank you. You're a liar. The you Quran can't. you have, according to who? You can't. I am I am challenging you to answer the Quran you have is according to who I asked, I asked you online right? why you don't want to answer your denomination? Why? You why? I, I don't follow domination I follow Jesus I follow the Christ okay, okay. you are a Muslim okay. who follow domination your prophet he said okay. your prophet he said my nation will be 73 sect are you accusing your prophet to be so, a liar so, so, so are you accusing your prophet to be a liar so are you a Trinitarian? Are you are you a person accusing your prophet? You there's nothing there's nothing in Christianity except those who believe in the Trinity. Even are, the Quran confirmed that. Abdul, are you stupid or what? Are you stupid or what? In your Quran, why your God Allah did not mention any sect except the the, the people who believe in the Trinity? Are, are you, you saying to me that your God Allah is ignorant, but you are not ignorant? What are you talking about? The Quran mentioned only people who believe in the Trinity. It, it said don't. Listen, answer. Why the Quran then did not mention except us, those who believe in the Trinity? He said, "Don't say Trinity." No, but he mentioned us only. He did not mention said, anyone except those who believe in the Trinity. So your God is short of knowledge. Now answer no, me. The saying, Quran you have. I answer you. I answer you about this. I answer you your question. I am a person who believe in the Trinity. It's your turn now. It says your. I answered you, uh, potato. You will not answer, right? You will not answer, correct? Let us make it simple. Are you going to answer or not? You're not saying nothing. I just said you asked me are you a person who believe in Trinity? I said yes Now and I'm I asking said, you I'm asking the you the Quran in the Quran in page a shut up shut up listen, listen listen You are a coward you won't answer right? Are you calling me? I and, did answer you. No, you didn't answer the Quran in page number a read it for me The Quran page a read what it says Sir don't serve me Read for me what I, page A says. I'm not gonna open up my Quran and do all that. You can open up the Quran and read it yourself. <laughs> if you know what it says. Okay, let me read for you. Hold on. Okay, read. No, you read it. Yeah, I will read it. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Okay. I will open the Quran. Thank, thank and, you very much. And people will see why you are refusing to read. And, and, and what translation are you reading? By I'm reading in Arabic, Abdul. Oh, okay. <laughs> translation. <laughs> Good one. Yeah, because you, you do a lot of what translation? What translation? You do a lot of pervasive translation is for you, for you people like you. Me. Listen, listen. This is page number Are eight. You at me? Did you just curse at me? Listen, listen. Page number eight. You are a kid. Oh, really? you, you are a serious kid. Yes. What, 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 I just showed you. I just showed you. I just showed you what your Quran is saying. And you are saying to me, I don't understand. Did you just say I don't understand Arabic? What was the verse you told me to look up? Did you just say I don't understand Arabic? No. What was the verse you told me to look up? I wasn't even reading the verse, you idiot. What was the verse you told me to look up? The <laughs> I wasn't reading the verse. I was reading page A in the Quran. Okay, so page A could be anywhere in different in different books. So it doesn't matter. What, this page what, is it doesn't matter what it's because there's crazy. there's only yeah, one like page, it. it's called A, what? you donkey. What? You are a donkey, you are a serious donkey. What, what do you mean it can be located anywhere? Who cares? It is page A. It doesn't matter where it's located. Page A in the Quran, what it does say. You 
funny. You are a donkey. You are not funny. You are you are you are a serious donkey. I said page A. Who care where it's located? Are you stupid or what? Are you stupid or what? How many page A in the Quran there is? Donkey, donkey. Listen, listen, guys. Look at this donkey. Look what he said. Which where it's located? I said to him page A. He said where it's located. <laughs> Where it's located? <laughs> I'm dying. Where is the? What do you mean? Where it's located? It's page A. Are you there? Are you there, Yo, Abdul? Are you there? Verses. Page A. Page A. What yeah, verses, you donkey? This is not a verse. This is not a verse. This is not a verse. You idiot. You stupid. You do not know Arabic. You do not know how to read your Quran. And I told you page A, and still you did not get it. Where is located page A? What it says? I don't see why you wouldn't just answer. Read. Answer. Everybody is laughing at you. You, you are a stupid idiot. Abdul, let me let me okay. Let me translate for you what I said. Hold on. Shut up. Shut up. It says that this Mus'haf is reported according to Hafs, according to Hafs Ibn Sulaiman, Ibn Al Maghira, Al Asid Al Kufi, according to Asim. According to uh, uh, Abdul Rahman or Abdullah ibn Sulma, according to Uthman, according to Ali, according to Yazid ibn Thabit, according to Abu Ka'b, according to the Prophet. So why you said to me it's not the same as the fake. Hadith is not according? You're fake. Why you are saying? Why you said the Quran? Why you said the Quran is not according the same as the Hadith? Why you did lie? Why you did lie? Coward. This is what I'm saying. Why you did lie? Listen what I'm saying. Why you did lie? Listen to what I'm saying. Why you did lie? What you do is you, wow. because you can speak Arabic somewhat, <laughs> you're not speaking proper Arabic, but you, but because you can do it, you can trick people. You can say, listen, Americans, I, I, I just it. said this. I did this not. Is what this says. I did not you, trick you. But you, I, but you asked me to read for you, you idiot. No, you asked I, me to read for you. Did you read? I asked you, you said to me in which you no listen, verses. listen, you donkey. Everybody heard you, it's recorded. You said to me which translation you are reading from. I said it's not translation, it's in Arabic. So it's, you said to me, go ahead. So you donkey, if you don't speak Arabic, why you said to me, read ahead? Why you said that? You go didn't. ahead. Why no, you said that? You did why you said that? You why you said me. that? You're trying to why why you say that I to me? Arabic, <laughs> I know what the Quran says. No, it's not true. You are just speaking. And you're making it sound like you know what you're saying. So, do, what I, you're so, so I, you are saying I don't speak Arabic? No, 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 I'm not saying that. So I'm saying you because you do speak Arabic, uh -huh. you're trying to convince people that you know what you're okay, talking. Okay, prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. Open the true. Quran and read for me a page sir, number A. Page sir. page A. Listen, donkey. No, I no. want you to prove me wrong. You are a coward. You are a son of muta. You are a son of a muta. You are not a real man. Right now, you open the Quran and you open page A and read for us what it says. The time is yours. Go ahead. I'm listening. Christian Prince. I'm listening. Okay. It's your then, time. Let me ask you. Let me ask you Don't ask me. Right? No, I no, want you to read no, page no, number no, A. Wait, 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 I wait, want you second. to read a, page one, A. One Shut up. I'm muted you now. You are being a coward. You said I am lying and playing games. So prove it. Read for me page A. I'm reading. I'm listening. Go ahead. If if you are so calm, listen, listen, right, and you are so ready to debate, coward, get out of here. You are just a kid, son of Muta. Coward. What's wrong with those Abdul? You call me to debate me, but you will never answer anything. <laughs> are you going to answer or not? Yes or I no? Your question. Yes or no? What? Yes or no? Yes or no? What? The page A is it exists in the Quran? I stop acting. Oh, come on. Is I'm it exist or not? not either gonna, you, either not, you say not, yes not, or you say no. It exists. Okay, right? then read it, it for us. Then read it for us. You, what you will lose will take of you will take you less than 30 seconds. Read it for no, us. No, no, read it for us. Because what, what I read it for you, us, coward. What I just told you. You see? What you, I just told you is I'm, I, I, I was looking up the Quran online, right? Uh -huh. So I don't know what page that would be. So Quran online is not the same as Quran in your book? I'm I'm saying I wouldn't know what page that would be. I told you, I told you page A. Are you stupid or what? No, page. All right, let me see if I can find it up here. Right? Now, see, you already <laughs> messed yourself up one time, right? No, no, let me show you how stupid you are. You 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 already messed yourself up one time, uh -huh. right? When you when you uh thought I wouldn't get on the phone. <laughs> so so now I'm gonna look, I'm gonna um find the Quran online uh -huh. and and go through the pages. Okay, that's all.
Okay, That's take all. your time. Take your time. I'm yeah, waiting. That's okay. Uh -huh. You're gonna learn today, buddy. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm learning. Yes. Uh, you gonna you're, you're gonna learn today. I'm learning already. No, you 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 you're not. The only thing you're learning right now is how to try to over talk. I'm learning, everyone. my friend. I'm just listening, waiting for you. No, you're trying to. You think it's fun. It's very fun. Trust me. I'm having a lot no, of fun. No, what, what's fun, what's fun. Now answer. Don't waste my time. No, Don't waste actually, my time. Go ahead, right. Get the page actually, eight. Actually, get the page actually, eight. you're right. It is funny because. Uh, let, let, me, you, let me let me make a bit. Let me make a bit. Donkey, let me make a bit. What if I say you will never find the page A? You make a challenge? Do you want to make a challenge? That you will never find it? Yes or no? What? You will not find the page A. What do you think? I won't find page A. Yes, you will not. Do you want a challenge? Why won't I find it? I don't know. You want to challenge? You want to bet? <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. You want to bet? One second. From one hundred dollar to one hundred dollar. Dude. <laughs> what? You're gonna, you you, you want to bet? You're gonna. I'm telling you, you're gonna you, be shocked. You want to bet? Second. You want to bet? You want to bet? bet? Do you want to bet? Okay. So, all right. You said you are said for sure it's there, it exists for sure. So you know it is there. Now I'm asking you, are you going to find it? Yeah, I'm going to find it. I don't think so because you will never do that. In purpose. Why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I do it? Okay, he does, okay we will wait. I will, I will wait for you. How long is it going to take you to find page number eight? Probably about uh, a few more minutes. Okay. Okay. We will and, and it's funny. It's funny because the, no, no, don't, don't tell me. No, no. I will put you in no, mute. No. I will put you on a mute. No, no, no. I, I, I want you to be busy looking for the page A. Don't waste your time. I will wait for you maximum of five minutes. If you don't find page A, it's mean you will never find it because in purpose you don't want to read it for us. So I'm waiting for you. Take your time. Five minutes. Right now it's three fifty-one. We will give you the mic in three fifty-six. I'm waiting. What is it? I'm waiting for you. I will give you five you minutes. I will give you five minutes. I will give you You're five minutes. Why don't you just say the church, the the uh, uh the um uh, 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 what, the uh, verse and chapter? What 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 chapter, idiot? What's wrong with you? I told you page number eight. Yeah, you saying page number eight? Yes, verse page four, number so. eight. Page number eight. Page number eight, and it did read it for you. And even I translated Everybody, for you. What's wrong with you? I translated for you. I translated for you. Thing. Find for it's me page page A. What page A? Can you find it? Page A is on uh, a, a, a a a not a two a a a a a a a a from Apple. I heard you. you yeah. Eight. Okay. So what do you mean, uh, to a surah? What surah? It starts. It starts at and we call them in your Quran. Quran in, in your Quran. Listen, and it says in your Quran. Page A. And, says, and, we, and it, we call that we saved you from Pharaoh's people. Abdul. Abdul. You in your Quran, Quran page A. Okay. Have, hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Potato. Hold on. This, this hold is, on. is page eight. And page it, page what? A or eight? This is eight. I did not say eight, you donkey. I said oh, a, no, a, no, a, 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 a as apple, a as apple, a as apple. You, you are, are a donkey. Funny. You are an official you donkey. Funny. I said page a. Okay, look no, at again. Look. Before, okay, look at again. Look at again. No problem. Page a. Page? Okay. Mm -hmm. Not a problem. No problem. You just gotta get embarrassed. Yes. Every time. All you're right. Stupid. <laughs> all right. And you're trying to distract everybody. <laughs> That's all you're doing. I'm waiting. So, okay. I'm not going to say anything. I'm just waiting. That, we better, no, we, we you, better you wait for the you're miracle. Just you're, you're just playing because you because for sure I'm playing. I'm playing, Abdul. Trying. I play you're with the playing. Muslims. I play with the you're Muslims. You are my joke. You, you are my win. joke. You are my you joke. Can't really debate. Okay, nobody. let us see. Let us see who can stupid. debate. Until now, you refuse to answer anything, and you are talking about debate. You you you, you coward. Until now, you refuse any question I gave you to answer. Even this one, you don't want to find it for us. Even to read it for us, you don't want to read it for us. <laughs> now read it for us. Find it and read it. You are funny. Sure, you know, I'm funny. You, you know what you did? All you did was try to distract everybody because you don't want me to ask you. No Read it for me. You asked so me you already. You asked me. I answered no. you. You said to me, "Do no. you believe in the Trinity?" I said, "Sure, I believe in the Trinity." No. You got Allah. No, you no, even no. mentioned that we have you, only one okay, sect in Christianity. So you let me ask you a now, don't ask a question. I want you to read a number first. Don't skip the topic and the challenge. You are no, you are being think, busted. Think, you are a liar. Just, you are busted. Your, read for me. Read for me, page A. See, guys, you will not read it, coward. Did you promise me a second ago that you will find it and for sure you or you know where it is? Did you? So why you are now jumping? Because simply it's very embarrassing. You are looking all over. You cannot find it. So did you find it or not?
He can't help it. Did you find it he or can't not? Help, Abdul, he can't you, help it. Just say, I did not find it. Just say, admit. Just say. Oh, I, I, no, I didn't find it. Because Why? It's full of crap. Why? What? Full of crap, guys. The Quran full of crap. The Quran <laughs> is full of crap. crap. This guy, he You're said the Quran. No, you are full of crap. Listen, listen. You see? So you, you did lie. You did lie. You said to me, you know where to find it. But now you said you don't know how to find it. Is that correct? Listen, what I'm saying is you why you cannot find it. Why you cannot find it? Forget question. about destruction. You see, destruction, yeah, destruction. No, I'm destroying you, Islam. No, listen, listen. Why you lie to me? You said, why you lie? Why you lie? No, you are a kid. Get lost, idiot. And don't ever dare to call me. You are a kid, stupid idiot. You don't even know how to find page A in the Quran. And you think what I read for you was a chapter in the Quran, you donkey. I said to you, this is the Quran. I even translate. I said, this is according to Hafs. Have you ever heard in the Quran the name Hafs, you donkey? I said to you, this is according to Suleiman ibn al-Mughira al-Asadi al-Kufi. Have you ever heard in the Quran those names? I said to you, this Quran is according to Asim ibn Najud al-Kufi al-Tabi'i and Abdi Abdul Rahman Abdullah ibn Habib al-Sulma. Have you ever heard those names in the Quran? How you stupid you thought that this is a verse in the Quran because you are a donkey You are an official donkey I'm not reading Quran for you you donkey. This is page a in the Quran, but it's not Quran And I even translate for you I said it says that this Quran is written according to Hafs. I said that to you According to Suleiman Ibn al-Mughir al-Kufi according to Asim According to Abdul Rahman, according to uh, to Uthman, according to Ali, Ali in the Quran, Ali ibn Abdul Muttalib in the Quran. Ibn Abi Talib in the Quran. Yazid ibn Thabit in the Quran. I did read them for you, but because you are an official donkey, you thought this is Quran. I do not need to debate you, you are gone. This guy, he thought that this is Quran. Do you see how stupid they are? He cannot recognize page A from the Quran. And the, the, what make it horrible, even I translated for him. And what make it horrible, I said, he said to me, what translation you are reading from? I said, not translation Arabic. He said, go ahead, go ahead. He act like if he know Arabic. Why you said to me, go ahead and read in Arabic. If you do not know Arabic, what the point? Huh? Why you ask me to read it? Go ahead. He will not answer any question, but yet you want to debate me. Do you know the Bible? No, I do not know the Bible. <laughs> do you know the Quran? <laughs> do you know page A? I did not even ask you any question about the Quran yet. I just asked you to read page number A. Hello. <laughs> and he want to debate me. <laughs> a Muslim who want to debate, but he will not answer any question. He want to ask me questions only. Do you know the, the Do you know the Bible? Do you know the Bible? No, I do not know the Bible. I'm ignorant. <laughs> I'm glad he called. Anyway, we have a good time. They are funny and they are cute. I want to grow them in my yard, but the, but the city is not allowed in me. This is the problem. I mean, <laughs> do you know the Bible? Christian friends, do you know the Bible? Huh? Do you know? And the Quran is not a hadith. The Quran in front of us, it says the Quran is a hadith. I did read for him the verse he could not understand because he's a donkey. Allah nazal al-ahsan al-hadithi kitaban mutashabihan. Look how stupid is even this verse. The, the verse saying that this is the best of the hadith is the Quran. And this guy, he said the hadith, the Quran is not a hadith. <laughs> and he said the Quran, the hadith is not sent from Allah. That's a lie. That's a lie. Anything Muhammad, he said, according to Islam, is from Allah. As long as it is Muhammad is saying it. So when we show you, idiot, that your prophet said that my nation will be 73 sect, it is from Allah. Because this is a prophecy, you donkey. Muhammad, he do not know the future. As the Quran, he says. The Quran says, I know nothing of the future. And if I know, I will take advantage of it. I'm just a human being like you. 
So when your prophet says my nation will be 73 sect and you don't you said to me I'm just a Muslim. That's mean you're accusing your prophet to be a liar For your prophet he said my nation is going to be 73 sect And you say to me we are just Muslims we are not sect since when since when Abdul Because you are a coward, I hang up on you. Get lost. <laughs> you will not answer anything. So why you are calling me? Okay, you know what? I'm going to call you back. When you say to me, I found page number A. Is that deal, guys? Is that a good deal? What do you think? Do you promise me to find page A? I will give you 15 minutes and I will call you back. What do you say? Do you agree? Do you agree, coward? Hmm? I will give you 15 minutes. Don't tell me in 15 minutes you will not find page A. I will give you D then. <laughs> he blocked me. <laughs> he hang up on me. <laughs> Let us see if he found it. Let's give him a chance. <laughs> I'm calling you. I'm calling you. Did you find page A? Answer, answer. Asana, <clears throat> come on, answer. Mm -hmm. He's offline. Come on, come online. We want to love. It says Asana is not online. <laughs> I think he's online. Let's try again. <coughs> Man, he is hanging up so fast. Come on, answer. Hello. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. Hello. Uh, your camera is open, by the way. Mute, 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 mute YouTube, please. So you don't have a, you don't have a problem. All right. Mute YouTube, please. You, you don't look good. Trust me. You look really like you are coming from a fight, and somebody did beat the hell of you. Mute YouTube. What's wrong with this guy? Guys, you should so you should see how his face look like. He look like somebody did punch him like one hundred times in the face. Let me call him again. <coughs> Hello? Mute YouTube, mute, mute YouTube, mute it. Hello? Mute YouTube. Can you mute YouTube? Listen to me oh, here. Okay. All yeah. right. All right. Okay, so why did you hang up on me? So did you find page A? Because you are refusing to answer anything. No, so why no, you no, talk? because what you why, why you want to talk? Why you want to talk if you want to answer anything? Okay, let us make a promise. Right. Well, well, let, first of all, let us make a promise. Let us make a promise. Okay, let us make a make a promise. A question from me, a question from you. Do you accept? Yes, I accept. Okay, okay but and you will answer, and you promise but, you will but, answer, and you promise you will answer. Yes, I will answer. Okay, I gave you a question already. Page A. Oh. Okay, I, I don't know where page eight is. A is because I read the English. But you say to me. But you say to me. I just said I don't know. You say you say to me. Okay, now so still I own you. So so still I own you a question. So still I own you a question. Then you said you said yes because you don't answer. You did not answer. You said I don't know. I mean, what kind of a question? This question is going to the answer. The answer is I don't know. I said no. That's me. So why you are calling me? Why you are calling me? Why you are calling me if you do not know? Listen. No, no, you don't have to be Arabic okay. Let me know. ask you have you ever heard of so page A? Have you, you ever heard? Have, have you ever heard of page A in the Quran? I just said no, okay. So, why you know, know how you how come you know that this page is exist? You told me it's exist. Listen to what I just said to you, yeah. 
you're trying to play a game where don't you're don't worry about what i play i play whatever i wish i want an answer i want an answer so now Sir. where is the answer where is the answer Christian, Christian, okay Christian, why you cannot find Christian, page a Christian, why you cannot Christian, find it why you cannot you find asked, it you said you we, didn't we make it a pledge to each no, other and we made the pledge i want you to read it for me I want Can you to read it. I want you to. I want you to read it. Yes, the promise. I want you no, to read page number the promise eight. You said. Okay, you go. Said, did I know? All right, all right. Okay, okay, guys. I said hey, no. Hey, okay, I did not. so the first one. Right? The first one no, is no, one to zero. I said no. Okay, you do not know, so you are ignorant about okay, the poem. So why are you? Keep so thank you. Okay, go and ask ask me a okay. question. Go ahead. Go okay. Ahead, go ahead. So that's done, right? That's uh -huh. done. Uh huh. Okay. Now, <laughs> since I know for a fact that mm. obviously when person reads it, I don't know Greek or Hebrew either, but I read the Bible. Mm -hmm. like you and you don't know greek or hebrew and mm -hmm. you read the bible mm -hmm. and you accept what it says mm -hmm. in english or whatever language you read it in mm -hmm. that's a fact so you don't know greek or hebrew and mm -hmm. i don't know arabic so give what? me the question so read... man give me the question no 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 so we so so that takes care of all that foolishness now no that no that now, that, now, that is not you. that it's that now, <laughs> <now>. <laughs> listen you stupid listen you stupid i ask you about a page existing in your quran your quran all translation is not accepted by muslims you go only by the Arabic version of it. Now, to prove that you are a liar, as long as you are extending the, 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 the topic, which a translation you accept to be original to the Quran? Your mind. No, no. L listen. Answer, answer. No, you no, told me you English you and you told question. me I Hebrew. You, you told me Hebrew and you told question. me English. So I'm asking you now. I didn't even give you a question. No, you, did not, you, you, <laughs> you are the one who opened the question now. You are no. the one who opened so, it. So, so you are the one question. who opened it. This is my question. Go ahead, go ahead. Will let you admit? Let us laugh. Let us laugh. You, will you admit <clears> that you do not know Hebrew or Greek and yet you read the Bible? That's not a problem for me. No, no, do don't. Is what it do required? Is it no, no, okay? No, okay, okay. Ask me a question. Did you ask me a no. question? We made a pledge, right? We made you, you we, the made a, we made a pledge. Do we made you, a pledge. Hold do on, do shut up, shut up, potato. Shut up. We made a pledge that you asked me. I answer you. I ask you. You answer me. Okay, I do not know Hebrew. I do not know Aramaic. And I don't have to. Now it's my turn to ask the question. Okay, yeah. Thank you very much. Your it's my turn. Okay. Yep. Why your prophet he said that the black dog is the devil? I, can we stick to the crown? Why are you keep throwing up these this, random this things? Is, I don't care about hello, the, I don't care what he said about a dog. Uh, I don't even care. No, you don't care. Then why you are calling me? Why you are saying you were going to answer dog. me? I don't care. Why would I care? What, you care, I care because he's a racist. Because he's a racist. No, we no, want to know. We, dog, this is my question. Is Respect yourself, man. You made the pledge. I want to know the answer. Why you're a prophet? He hates black dogs. <laughs> Why he hates black dogs? I want to know. Yeah, okay, you know what? Okay, so you said that statement, right? So let me say the statement. Hmm. So uh, there was a uh, uh, one of you guys. Um, I think it might have been you two. Was talking about Muhammad's racist because he said something about um, even if it, uh, the you know respect the person who's doing the uh, who's your leader, even if he was a, a racist. This is another right? question. Did, did I ask no, no, about this? Listen. Listen, said, I want. I am said, asking a specific. Said, shut up, donkey! You made a promise. You will answer the question. I did not ask you about different question. I said you're a prophet. He believed that the black dog is the devil. What do you, you say? Understand? Did you what, understand that? What, racism what, not just what black? do you say? What is All that? What do you racism. What do you say of that? That the black dog about is the devil. About what? Why your prophet considered the black dog is the devil and we must kill him. I don't know if he even said that. He that said that sounds, it's in the front of us. It's in the front of us. It's a hadith. Not in the Quran. It's a hadith. It's not in the Quran. It doesn't matter. It's a hadith, and your prophet said that. All the hadith are not authentic. Ah, but this one is authentic. No, how, oh really? Yes, it's Sahih Muslim and Sahih. It says Sahih. It so, says. So, so, it says so Sahih. It says Sahih. You are you going to answer or not? Are you going to answer or not? So, I, I I just answered it. Where? First of all, you, you you what you're not understanding. I don't even care if he said it. That doesn't make it good or bad. You or don't right care. Or you don't care. So why you are the calling me? Are sayings? They are not holy words. <laughs> he can have his get own lost, Get lost. Get wants. lost. Get lost. Get lost. Don't call me again. Get lost. I don't care, guys. Is that a debate? We are going to debate by saying I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> get lost. <laughs> What a debate is what did what this debate is about? I don't care what he said. <laughs> is that in the Quran? <laughs> I said to him, it's a hadith. He said, Is that the Quran? <laughs> I don't
don't care what he said. <laughs> Did you say he's racist? Uh, you said that he is uh, obeying the, 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 the African guy. I did not mention that story. Wait. <laughs> and guys, the funny one question from you, one question from me. Do you know? Do you know? Who, do you know Hebrew? <laughs> I thought he was going to give me like a, a very heavy duty question from the Bible. Do you know Hebrew? <laughs> no, I do not know Hebrew. Do you know Arabic? No, I do not know Arabic. <laughs> the idiot he forgot that in his cult. He have to pray to Allah in Arabic for Allah is an Arab guy For us as a Christian we can pray to God in any language The Quran says it clearly we made it in a pure Arabic and you have to pray to Allah in the Quran language you idiot So how you are going to teach me and answer me about Islam, but yet you do not know even how to say your prophet name correctly For me as a Christian. I do not need to speak one word in Hebrew neither in Greek I don't have to you have to you pray to Allah five times a day using the stupid Arabic language for you are the slave of the Arab so you have to what you are I'm muting you I'm not muting you you are not answering you are saying to me I don't I don't care what a donkey you are what kind of debate this debate is you will not answer anything each time I give you a question you don't want to answer I ask you to read about the page number a you don't want to read it and then you admit that you cannot find it so you spend 20 minutes lying to me saying I yeah I know it is it's a chapter what a chapter you donkey what a chapter I told you this is the Quran says this Quran is according to according to according to according to this is not a chapter but because you are just a potato who do not know Arabic you are just a copy paste that, that like the rest of you you skip it and you thought ah i can say i know i know i don't I, i'm not like if you ask me read it i will say no i'm not going to read it and this is how it end the same now you told me let us make a pledge i asked you a question you answer you ask me a question we answer okay i ask you a question what do you say to me i don't care how stupid you are and the funny this is all is recorded people will die laughing at you what do you mean you don't care i will give you another chance are you willing to answer if i call you back say yes or no are you willing to answer why your god muhammad he wanted to kill the black dogs say yes i will call you because this is a very important topic we want to know why Muhammad he have what he have something against the black color why he considered the black person is the devil I want to know this is very important for me are you going to answer or not and the stupid idiot he himself is a black how a black person follows such a faithy prophet who believe that just a dog because he's a black he is the devil I did not even go deep in the cult of Islam. And by the way, I can show you the racism against the black in the Quran. The Quran says, The day faces will turn black and faces will turn white. And we can read the interpretation according to your prophet where it says clearly that this is literally about people being black and people being white. Are you there? Guys, you should see his face. His face looked like he have tons of bunch in his face, and he looks so bad. I feel sorry for him. Christian Prince, I don't care, and uh, you are not allowed. And if we want to debate, we, you are not allowed to ask me question. I will ask you questions only. What do you know about the Bible? Are you talking about the Bible of Allah, brother? The Bible of Allah, because the Bible is the book of Allah anyway, supposedly. The Abdul. They try to ask you about the Bible to prove to you that the Bible is corrupt. Okay, the Bible of Allah is corrupt. Manipulating the coal? I did not manipulate any. Okay, I will give you one. I will give you one chance, one more chance, guys. Should I call him again? What do you think? Did you find the answer or not? 
are you going to answer me about my question we made it we made a deal we made a deal that you ask me a question I ask you a question it's my turn are you going to ask are you going to answer or you will ask only so I'm willing to give you one more shot be a man keep your promise you give me a question I give you a question now it's my turn why your prophet he sent he think and he believe that the dog if he is a black should be killed and he is the devil I'm calling you I'm expecting an answer <clears throat> Assalamu alaikum Abdul. Abdul, assalamu alaikum. Do you hear me answer? <laughs> Guys, you should see, you should see what's happening to him. Should I show you in the in the in the screen? People will die laughing. So, so why 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 you keep hanging up the phone and then because you don't want to answer what the what no, the point of this debate the like why you are like you, why you don't want to answer okay hold, hold on don't, don't waste my time don't waste my time don't waste my time okay why your prophet you think you. why your prophet think that the black dog is the devil I'm, I'm listening and what did i tell you what you did not answer i want i want the answer why I did answer no i said that is not my concern why would it be then get lost it's my Ooh. concern it's my question you promised me you would answer me you idiot so if each time I ask you a question, you say to me, it's not my concern. So why you are calling you donkey? Have you ever heard of a debate? The other person says to me, I don't concern. So why you are calling me? <laughs> Guys, it's not my concern. It's my concern. It's my question. <laughs> we made a promise. <laughs> it's not my concern. <laughs> have you ever heard of a debate like this it's not my okay call me call me I will tell you you ask me a question I will say to you it's not my concern so each time I ask you a question you say to me not my concern each time you call me or ask me a question I will say to you not my concern here we go I mean this is the most lovely amazing debate ever in history ask me a question Christian Prince do you know what the Prophet Salomon he said no and it's not my concern skip the question now it's my turn do you know that your prophet he said if you shake your penis three time allah accept that from you why um it's not my concern now it's my turn okay a uh, christian prince why jesus he called his mother women um hmm. okay it's not my concern it's my turn now okay <laughs> <laughs> guys we are going to change the title of the debate we will call it not my concern topic the topic is not my concern <laughs> oh boy <clears throat> you know what i think this guy if he is married his wife she would say to him husband isn't it time to make babies he would say to her is not my concern Husband, we don't have food in the kitchen. Go and do shopping. It's not my concern. Husband, I'm sleeping with a neighbor. Uh, it's not my concern. What? Yeah, you just said it's not my concern. Or <laughs> it's not his concern. <laughs> Talk to you about what, you donkey. You are stupid. Have you ever heard of such a debate? Not my concern. Shame on you. You are just a kid. Shame on you even to be a black person and following such a filthy idiot. His name is Muhammad. Don't you see that this guy, he hate black color? Do you know that Muhammad, he said that the black stone used to be white like milk and the sin made it black, which means he believed that sin make you black? Are you stupid? You must be. I say to you, read for me page number A, and you spend 30 minutes looking for page number A, but you don't even know where is page number A is located. And the funny, he says to me, where is page A is located? <laughs> it's like, guys, somebody says to you, read for me page number 50, and you say to him, where is located? I just told you, page number 50. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> If there is any Muslim woman, she is single here. This guy, he have two more vacancies. 
and you can tell he is so genius you will be enjoying your life with him where it's where we can find them page a I just told you it's page a where I told you page a where is located like a in the Quran where <laughs> <laughs> that is a hilarious debate. <clears throat> you are playing games, Christian Prince. You are playing games. Do you speak Hebrew? No, I don't speak Hebrew. Do you speak Aramaic? No, I don't speak Aramaic. I don't have to. My God did not say to me, if you want to pray to me, you pray in Hebrew. It's your God who says that. This is not what I said, Doctor. Wake up! What I said, he left as a horse. He never came back as a donkey. I mean, sorry, he left as a donkey. He never came back as a horse. This is a Chinese says that if a person is a donkey, you don't try. He left. You know, you see, because when people they go to travel, if you go travel around the world, that will increase your wisdom, your experience. You will be a different man. But if you are a donkey, don't try. He left as a donkey, he never came back as a horse. So don't expect a donkey leaving will come back as a horse. He was a donkey and he will stay as a donkey. And here we go, this guy. He is asking a question, he's answered me. Uh, it's not my concern. Why do you know why he said that, guys? He's ashamed. As simple as that. He's just trying to skip it. The same as when he said to me, the Quran is not the same as the Hadith. When the Quran says that the best of the Hadith is the Quran. Chapter 39, verse number 23. I read for him names of Uthman and Ali and etc. And the Egypt, he thinks this is Quran. So he's asking me what chapter did you read for me? I did not read any chapter. And the funny, I even translated for him. I said, this Quran is written according according to recitation of Hafs, Ibn Sulaiman, Ibn Maghira, Al Asadi, Al Kufi. According to Asim, I said I said the word according. And it's still the stupid. He says to me, which chapter is that? And Christian Prince, do you know your Bible? No, I do not know my Bible. I'm ignorant. <laughs> <laughs> what you expect me to say? I know. What you expect me to say? I'm a scholar. Hmm? See, so people they speak about you and your knowledge. You don't speak about yourself. I mean, why you want to do that? People they will witness is that this guy he know what he's talking about, or he don't know. The same as they are talking about you and about me now. And your answer was amazing. It's not my concern. I, you know, this is a very sharp, very smart move from you. Not my concern. Okay, let us move to second question. Why you're a prophet? Ah, we should not mention that. This is bad, bad. It's going to be in my coming book. Guys, in my coming book, you will read things I never spoke about here. But you better be careful. This book is only for adult. <clears throat> Another chance for what? He will say to me, not my concern. I mean, that's it. From the beginning, from the first second he called, he didn't want to answer anything. From the first second, he is the one who asked me if you are a Catholic or a Protestant. Why you are asking me that? There is nothing in the Bible about a Catholic or a Protestant. Jesus did not say, go and become sect. I am a follower of Jesus. I don't follow Catholic, I don't follow Protestant, I follow the Messiah. Your prophet is the one who said, my nation will be 73 sect, not me. And as long your prophet says so, then you cannot say to me that I am not. That's mean your prophet, he did lie. Your prophet did not say that you will stay one sect. That's mean your prophet, he made a false prophecy. I made him start the talk. I told him, what do you want to ask me? He started talking, blah, blah, blah. Did you go go and play the debate from the, the I mean, we can't call it debate. Uh, 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 play it from the beginning. I said, what do you want to say to me? Why you are calling me? Ask me.
no I am not a Protestant and I am not a Catholic and I don't believe in any sect I reject not their teaching I reject the division and I believe the vision is coming from Satan Satan he wants us to be divided the same as the Quran says in chapter 5 verse 14 Allah he said I will spread hate and enmity between the Christians from now until the judgment day so anyone support the vision he is without knowing even the good guys you know from both side the more they divide the more they are serving the cult of Islam and serving the fake God Allah I am a follower of the Messiah and I don't follow a priest I don't follow a bishop for every man is a sinner including me why well, I want to follow a man is that correct guy the one who trusts a man he's a fool we trust only one God who is the one who will never change and nobody can corrupt him you trust a man you are just a stupid you are seriously stupid who, who you want to trust a bishop he's a sinner like you he confessed for his sin every Sunday. I am a sinner, he is a sinner, so why I want to trust him? Maybe you are better than the bishop, you go to his church, maybe. Maybe he's a bad person, maybe he's a corrupt, maybe he's a child molester like Muhammad, maybe. So why you want to follow a man? We follow the Messiah, and that is, that's it. I don't care for names. Names mean nothing for me. There's only you see when when I, I I gave myself a name this is a name I gave it to myself what what is my name Christian Prince oh, what does that mean I am a prince for my king is a Christ I am the child of God I belong only to him I don't care really for my name in the life real life for this is my name which I choose to be. I belong to him. I don't belong to a man. I don't belong to any person. If you can find me better name to have to attach it to myself, let me know. We have the Messiah who never commits sin. We have a person who promised us to be with us as we speak right now. This person is our God. He promised us every two of you mention my name I will be between you I will be the third and the Muslim they say to us oh where Jesus said he's God okay how you can be between us right now as we speak how he can be everywhere because in order to do you know how many Christian there is in this earth right now praying in churches or in houses billions so how he can be between them So for us, we cannot find better name. And I advise all the Christians, with my respect to all of you, you are a Catholic, you are a Protestant, I love you all, but there's no name better to follow than the name of Christ. Don't follow a bishop, don't follow a priest, they will divide us. Many of them, they are doing business. This guy, he will say to you, oh, only my church will go to heaven. If, if you hear that, that's mean this guy is not working for Jesus. Who is he? Who is he to decide who will go to heaven, who will go to hell? Why? Why? Imagine there's an old woman. She is 70, 80 years old. She loved the Messiah from her heart. She pray and she cry. When she when she pray, she pray from her heart. This woman, she will go to hell. Why? Oh, because she is a Catholic. That's a lie. Or a woman, she is the same age, but she is a Protestant, and then a Catholic person. Oh, she will go to hell because she's. This is a lie. The Messiah said, "Whoever believe in me and die will live." Whoever. There's no Catholic, there's no Protestant. Anyone who says to you that only a church name is the one who will go to heaven, he is fooling you. It's against the teaching of Christ. The Messiah, he said, from their fruits, you shall know them, not from their names. Your name can be Christian Prince, you can be Muhammad, can be whatever. Who care? One of you, he said in the text uh, uh, yesterday, before we finish our uh, broadcast, he said, you don't deserve salvation, which means he's speaking about in Christianity, we don't deserve salvation. But my friend, you see, some people, they got they got a wrong idea about what deserve mean. You don't deserve salvation, yes and no. Yes mean that at the end of the day, you are a sinner. 
Yes, you are a sinner, which means you will never be clean. And no, you deserve salvation because God, he said, God said, not because I said you deserve. God, he said, not everyone says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of my father, but the one who do his will. So he gave you a chance to be deserved. Are you getting my point? So you as a sinner, you don't deserve salvation. You don't, you don't deserve to go to heaven. Go, go, kid. Don't call me. Go. Stupid idiot. Not my concern. Don't ever even try. Are you guys listening? I don't deserve salvation. This is true because I am a sinner. If I commit one time sin, I am a sinner. I'm not going. It's, you know, sin is like a crack in the glass. If you put some glue, still the crack is there. Is that correct? Hold on, Michael. You can call me, but give me a second, please. So when you have the crack in the glass, the glass, the glass is not the same as before. You are not pure no more. So you are a person don't deserve to go to heaven because heaven is the place of the poor one, pure one, sorry. But God, our Lord, he gave you a chance to deserve. This is why I say we don't deserve yes and no. It's not me who said you deserve or not. Our Lord, he said, he put rules in order to be qualified to go to heaven. Whoever believe in me, he deserved to go to heaven. That's what he's saying. According to him, you see, I'm not I'm not the one saying I deserve to go because I think I'm good. No, but he said, if you believe in me, for me, in my eye, you deserve now to go to heaven, which means you are qualified. If you do the fruits, which I ask you for, you are qualified. If you do the will of my father, if you follow my step, if you go and preach and teach, if you do the work of your father, Abraham, so we don't deserve because of sin, but in the same time, he opened a chance for us to deserve it again. But this is a chance which is a gift from him, not because really we deserve it. You know what I mean? It's like somebody saying to you, you know what? You, you don't deserve really to pass this class. You get D all the way. But I will give you a chance. And this chance is a gift from me, not because you deserve it. If you do this, then I will consider you deserve to come and be in my house. So for us, nobody deserves to go to heaven and deserve to have salvation because we are sinners. But because of his mercy, he gave us the chance. And he said to us, you do this and this and this. And then I will consider you. And I promise you, not only consider you. You see, we promised by the Messiah the salvation. So here, by the promise of the Messiah, then we deserve it. By his promise, not by our qualification, let us say. Not because we are good. There's no good save God. So if you do this and this and this, then you are qualified to go to heaven. And we can say, we can use then the word deserve, but not in the real meaning that people use it in the street. Let us say, God gave us a new chance. So I don't deserve to go to heaven based on my deeds. Yes. However, if I do certain things, you can call it deeds, you can call it good things, you can call it whatever you want. Starting from faith to believe. The, start, uh, the second you start having faith in Christ, you are opening the way for yourself for salvation. So the salvation door is not closed. The Messiah said, knock at my door and I will open for you. Knock, I will open. So he made a promise that if you knock, I will open. It's not closed. And that is a door you knock before you die. After you die, that's it, it's too late. So knock and all will open for you. From their fruits, you shall know them. So how Christ will recognize you and recognize me in the day of judgment? Not because you are a Catholic, he is a Protestant, you know, she is uh, Orthodox. That's not the last of his concern. His concern is from their fruits, 
he shall know them so we are required to do fruits some some false teachers they say to you the fruits will not help you that's a lie the Bible, are you saying Jesus did was wrong did he say from their fruits you would know them he said that did he say that the tree which does not give fruits will cut off and throw him in the hellfire he said that so they lie to you they say it's not required to do good deeds or fruit it's required and why it's required required because if you are a fake christian then you have a fake fruit so for for the lord the fruits is something will happen automatically from you it's not required as requirement let us say you have to do this and that no if you are real then be real and real faith bring real fruits a person who have faith in Christ he will not let somebody homeless in the winter die in front of his door that mean he is a fake Christian so he did not ask you to feed that person but he said in the Bible I was hungry and you feeded me I was a prisoner and you visited me I was a stranger and you took me in is that correct guys did the Messiah says that so we we when we take a foreigner and when we take a stranger and when we feed the poor and when we visit the one in jail we are bringing Christ to our house he is saying to you when you do that to them you are doing it to me so what do you mean I don't need to do those things those who says to you we do not need to do good things they are working for the devil so what is the point of you being a Christian then if you will not feed the poor if you will not give refuge for the one who need your help if you don't help people around you so what is the benefit of you we are worms we eat and we we have sex and we do poo-poo and then we die. That's it. If somebody says to you, you are saved just because you believe in Jesus, he's lying to you. The fruit of faith can be accepted only the only fruit if you are the case of someone like the thief who was next to Jesus. You remember the story, guys? There was a thief next to Jesus in the cross. Now, this guy, he cannot do any more fruit. He's in the cross. He accepted Jesus by faith. And the Messiah, he promised him to be in heaven. But that is a special person in a special position, a special location, a special timing. If we want to understand what the Messiah wants from us, then... We don't take one sentence of his statement saying, whoever believe in me and die will live. Yes, whoever believe in me and die and live. But he said too, not everyone says to me, Lord, Lord, but the one who do the will of my father. He would do what? He would enter the kingdom of my father. So he have requirement starting from faith and true faith, or let us say, the Bible says faith without fruits is a dead faith. So how you have faith, but you don't have a fruit. Uh, let me, uh, uh, what's what his name? Uh, Michael Solomon, if you want to call me my friend, uh, feel free to call. All right. Go ahead, you can call me. <clears throat> all right go ahead you know we don't deserve salvation hello peace brother hey michael how are you very well very well let me turn down skype here Okay, I have it muted. I just wanted to say thank you for your message after the call with Osama. This is 
probably my favorite part of any of your shows. We talk about Christianity and Jesus. Um, I, I think it's important, the work that you do. And I hope that the people that come in and listen, they're not just, you know, coming in to listen to you beat up, you know, Muslims, you know, that it's unfortunate that they get that type of treatment, but sometimes you have to, you know, address them in a way that they'll actually maybe listen and open up. Can you hear me? Uh, uh, Michael, can you do me a favor? Don't move your mic because it's making noise. I don't know if you have a fan or something. It's making. Maybe I think you're moving it around. It's making like a bad noise. If you don't mind, please. Um, you know what? There is a fan on. Could you give me a second to turn it All off? All right. Okay. <clears throat> no, if you have a fan always, it does that, you know. That's why I'm expecting him to be like he maybe have a fan uh, facing him. That's That's a lot better. I apologize. Oh, no problem. No problem. It's all right. Go ahead. I'm about listening. Uh, so, so thanks for at least letting me, you know, come in with that uh, that uh, statement to begin with. Uh, my question is: is <clears throat> why wasn't Asama answering the question about the dog? Because I feel that this is a very important question when it comes to uh, Islam in general. Yeah, he he won't answer anything. This guy he is just calling. He, you know, the game is as the following. We ask him a question before he finished the first question. We ask him second question. You know what I mean? This mm -hmm. is what this this is what they do. They hit you with second question, and the 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 point the 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 point of this call is to make you busy trying to answer them. But they will not give you a chance to ask them questions. I know their games, you know, and they cannot play with me. They can they can do that with someone else. You know, I'm sure this guy, if he calls someone else, he will be successful to play games. He will never answer anything. But if, if when you debate Muslims, you have to force rules on them. You have to force them to answer. Otherwise, they will never. And here we go with all my effort. Still, he don't want to answer. So we 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 corner him. Then what he say? Not of my Not concern. Of concern. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So in Islam, why are dogs more powerful than angels? You don't know, not not of my concern. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, not of my concern. Uh, why, when I waste my time with a kid like this, he will say to me, "Not of my concern." What what, what we will do in this conversation? It's funny. Imagine I asked you a question, you say to me, "Not my concern." Then you ask me a question, I say to you, "Not my concern." Okay. <laughs> so. It's kind of a vanilla conversation, but nothing is your concern. Well, the, the 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 point is, he have no idea what I'm talking about, and this guy is afraid and he's terrified. And I know their game. You know, they 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 will they will uh, you know they open a website, and they copy a question from the website and they throw it at you. And now the Christian usually he start quoting for them verses from the Bible, trying to prove them wrong, etc. And but he's not even listening. He, he have already uh, he copy another question from that website and he will throw it at you before even you finish the, the first question this is the this is the what this is what they do when they when they speak to Christians nobody is listening and for me uh, even if you try you know let, let me make it clear for all the Muslims if you ask me a question about the Bible I will answer you from the Quran because it's a waste of time to speak to you about the Bible you will get my answer from Islam and I will beat you the reason I do that because you don't believe in the Bible anyway and right. you are not even listening and the same questions we answer them thousands of times before but you will repeat them tomorrow and today and next week the same questions the same person will call you again you say to me the Bible is corrupt thank you very much are you talking about my Bible he will say yes I said to you I don't have a Bible this is the book of God so you are talking about the book which is sent by Allah supposedly he will say yes okay so what's my problem what kind of a stupid God he sent the Bible but he cannot protect his Bible for at the end of the day the book is belong to the one who sent it not to me I am a follower I am NOT a maker so what kind of God his name is Allah he sent the book but he cannot 
protect his book. What was the name of the ant prophet? You know, the chapter of the, the Valley of the Ants. Who was the prophet there? Uh, Suleiman. 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 Yeah. Okay. And by the way, I know many people, their name is Suleiman, and they can speak to ants. I, I can't. Oh, you cannot? Your name is Suleiman? No, no, no. Well, my, my <laughs> confirmed name is Suleiman. I'm... You are getting close. I think you, I think you might understand some words. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really. Yeah, well, it's a stupid religion. You know, don't ever, when a Muslim he sp speak about uh, the Bible is not a true book, don't don't try to prove him to prove him wrong. Say to him, you are talking about the Bible of Allah as wrong. We agree. And you will see how his face will turn upside down. The stupid Muslim he is attacking the book of his God, not my book. Because remember, the Quran says it clearly that it is Allah who sent the Injil. The Injil supposedly is the New Testament, and the Quran says that Allah He is the one who sent the Torah, and the Torah supposedly is an Old Testament. And Allah He spend even speak about the book of David. So all those books are the book of Allah. So what's my business? The Muslim trying to prove to me that the books of his God is corrupt. That is additional proof not to believe in Allah. For if Allah is God, he should not allow his books to be corrupt. Agreed. What kind of God? You see, we human, we die. I die. Somebody after me, he might play with my book. But we are talking about God. And this God, he is eternal, supposedly. So how we can corrupt his book? And how he allowed such a thing to happen. He cannot have a copy in the site. Where is the original copy of the Bible? Which Allah, he is supposedly, should have one of it. Can't he send us one copy? Can't he give Muhammad a copy of the Bible? Why he did not give Muhammad a copy? You see, he gave him Quran. What about you give him the book of Adam, the book of uh, David, the book of uh, Abraham, the book? Because Muslims believe in 124,000 messenger. Why Allah did not give him? A copy, what he will lose, for everything wow. is fake. Who can know how how many pages are in that book from Allah? I mean, you know, there's you know, he gives you a, a passage, and then later he changes his mind and gives you a new one, and you know that that could be a book that they couldn't even carry around in the desert. You know, if God claimed to be God, there is nothing impossible for him. So. Allah, he made the tablet for Musa, according to Muslims, according to the Quran. Allah, he gave all the Torah, it's not the Ten Commandments, in tablets. So imagine how many trucks Musa was carrying with him. All right? That would, that would be a lot of camels. A lot of camels. Trucks, let us say trucks. You know, let us say, I like. <laughs> <laughs> so how come Allah, he gave Musa all the, uh, the Torah in tablets, but he cannot give Muhammad even the Ten Commandments in tablet? What about you give him the Ten Commandments of Musa's in tablet? Why Allah did not even write anything to Muhammad? Why Allah he wrote the, the, the Torah in the hand of Allah to Musa's? Any Muslim can answer? They cannot answer. Mm -hmm. You know, for us, if you ask me the same question about what about God did not give anything to Jesus because he is God. <laughs> <laughs> well, Allah couldn't make uh, Muhammad read, but he can make a donkey talk. So, hey, there you go. Uh, well, you know, uh, when when uh, when the angel squeezed Muhammad three times and he keeps saying to him, "Read," this is one of the most funny, hilarious uh, uh, scene. Imagine you make a movie about. It. I, I, I wish I am. I have enough money to make a movie. A guy, he is supposed to speaking and he is saying what Allah is saying, and then he says to me, "Read," and then he squeezes me, and after each squeeze, I, I cannot even breathe, and then I say to him, "I cannot read," and then he squeezes me again and he scream at me, saying to me, "Read." And I said to him, I cannot read. And then he squeezed me again. And I said to him, I cannot read. And so all this squeezing, what was the point of it? Muslims have no idea. Did Muhammad learn how to read? Muslims, they say no. So why he is saying to him, read, if the guy cannot even read? And why he is squeezing him if he cannot, will not understand or he will not be able to do so? So what's the point? It almost sounds like a Three Stooges movie. Well, it's it's like a mayonnaise movie, you know. Uh, somebody trying to get the mayonnaise out of Muhammad. <laughs> <laughs> now this is odd. 
I, I recall watching one of your programs maybe a year ago or so where Muhammad was uh, in the act of passing away and he had asked for pen and paper to write down some final thoughts. So he couldn't read, but he could write. He could imagine himself doing things, but he didn't do it. So what's the real truth in the no, Quran? See, is what I want to know. Yeah, you see the Muslims, they say he cannot read. I believe, I believe that the Muslims, as usual, they have wrong understanding of their Quran. Muhammad nowhere he says he can't read all right but this is the stupidity of the Muslims as usual the Quran says clearly that or let us say the Quran divide the people between uh, uh, the kind of people who they are pagans and those are the one who they are illiterate and those who have people of the book so the Quran when the Quran called Muhammad the the prophet the illiterate He's talking about literacy about God. He was from a pagan family. He is not from a family who believe in God, the true God. The Muslim, they lie to us and lie to, to, to themselves. They say that the prophet used to be following Abraham. But how he can follow Abraham if none of his family was following Abraham? Same time, the Quran confirmed that he never followed anything. Muhammad, he do not even have faith and he do not have knowledge. Uh, and because of that the Quran called Muhammad that he is a person who have no faith and he have no knowledge in the scriptures and this is why he is illiterate but the Muslims because they are disconnected with their cult they got uh, 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 the meaning wrong if we go to chapter 42 verse number 52 and I hope the Muslims are looking at the screen you will see the following it says and thus have we by our command send inspiration to thee though knowest not before what was revelation and what was faith okay so Muhammad was a person who do not know what is faith and what is revelation that what the Quran meant by Muhammad being illiterate but the ignorance of the Muslims is amazing they believe that the word illiterate mean illiterate as a person cannot read I can't write but there is tons of reference in the Quran speaking clearly that this word have nothing to do with illiteracy of knowing how to read how to write as an example when the Quran divide the people or uh, you know says that the people of the book and the illiterate okay so the people of the book all of them they know how to write how to read impossible especially in the old days there's no way that everybody knows how to read how to write if you see if you read with me here chapter 3 verse number 20 it says say to those who be given the book and the illiterate so who is the one not considered illiterate here the one who have a book are you getting me Michael Yes, I am loud and clear. Yeah. I get it now. So, so the the uh, the Quran divide people between two kinds of people: people who have a book already, so they are not illiterate about God, not about writing or reading. And the the meaning is so clear, but because the Muslims they are so much disconnected with their cult, it says here. So, if they dispute with thee, say, I have surrendered my my whole self to Allah. And so have those who follow me and say to the people of the book and those who are unlearned uh -huh. So the Quran divide people between two kinds of people people who they are learned and People who they are unlearned who are the, the people are learned the one who called them the people of the book What book the book of God who are they the Jews and the Christians? It is very clear. It's very simple, but Muslims are copy-paste 300 400 years after Muhammad somebody come with the interpretation that Muhammad was illiterate because the Quran say he is illiterate But the fact as you see the Quran never say so He is from the pagan he don't have faith he don't have a belief and he was illiterate and now we guided you He was a Sabian before right he was nothing he was not a Sabian before he was nothing he was a pagan Simply a normal pagan like all the Arab around 
you know. Uh, but then he try. Sabian is a stage of his life to make himself. You see, Muhammad is a is a Sabian with a Sabian. He is uh, uh, he's like he like he's like Obama. Obama he go to a black church. Huh? Suddenly he's black. He go to white church. He's white, and he's a Christian. He go to uh, uh, Muslims. He speak about Allah. He go to the Jews. He wear the hat. And he shake his head in in the front of the of the temple of of Solomon in in in, the, in Jerusalem, and even he write a prayer and he wrote a wish and he put it in the in in the in the wall. So he is he is a person who changed his religion. The bent he is with who in the front of the Arab who kissed the black stone he kissed the black stone. They go around the Kaaba he go around the Kaaba. With the Christians he believe in Jesus. With the Jews he believe in Moses. With the Sabian he's a Sabian. He is with everybody. Just believe in me. This guy is a hypocrite. He's a scammer. Whatever. So that's why there's so much politics in Islam. Then he is a. It's a, actually even the Muslim. They say to you, if you ask them why the Prophet marry a lot of women, go and see what the Muslim they will say. Because he was trying to spread Islam. They admit. So Muhammad he used even women in order to spread his religion. If you are a true prophet, you do not do that. You know, if God he send you. Why you are working your own plan, and the plan is involving sex and women? What do you do? You do you agree with the using a women to spread up your own agenda? You know, so he's not even marrying to have a family. The purpose of marriage is family. If the purpose is politics, that is deception, and this is devil. And yet the Muslims they have no problem to say that their prophet he marry a woman just to spread Islam. And why he marry Aisha? She is six years old to spread Islam. Her father converted to Islam before she became a wife. He do not need to spread Islam by her. What do you mean spread Islam? What about well, that, was, that was just pedophilia? I mean, yeah, yeah. So, so it's just an excuse trying to defend his his uh, his mad behavior. But it's true that Muhammad he do things. Uh, uh, he he used people for his uh, for his purpose. He don't have a religion. Islam is not a religion. Islam is a collection of many, uh, uh, many things together. It's not a religion. It's some from Christianity, some from the Jews, some from the uh, uh, the Arab, some from the Yemeni, some from the Sabi, and uh, some from everywhere. And this is why Islam is not in harmony with itself. You know, and Muhammad because he used violence. You see, when Muhammad. Muhammad is the one who established the rules of, uh, let us say, self-destruction for Islam. You know, some people, they say to me, so are you destroying Islam? I'm not really destroying Islam. I'm just explaining Islam. Islam destroying itself. Uh, the Quran speaks clearly. The, Muhammad, he, make a, he made a verse in the Quran. And this verse uh, speak. Of how Islam is going to be destroyed, Muhammad he put a rule: of any group of you is not being just, you kill them. Not being just in what? In not following the right group, not just with the Christians or just no, about not to be just with other Muslims. So if any group of uh, uh, is like that, you kill them. So now what the Muslims do? Every group of Muslim they say to the other one, you are not just. So we have the right to kill him. <clears throat> you know what I mean? So any in disagreement. Any in disagreement become unjust accusation. So everyone says to the other person, you are unjust. This is why you see ISIS, they made a fatwa on Al-Qaeda. They want to kill them. Al-Qaeda have a fatwa on ISIS, but both of them, they are supposed to Mujahideen, and they want to, uh, uh, you know, kill it. But now they want to kill each other. Why? Because simply, Muhammad, he put the rule. And the rule is very simple. If two of your group of you have a fight, fix between them. And if one of them still go and the trans, uh, uh, transgress, kill it. And that is the case between Muslims now. Islam is wow. gone because of this verse, chapter 49, verse number 9. Well, how can they know what Quran is the right Quran? There's... 
all different kind of Arabic Qurans. I mean, none of them really truly agree. Yeah, but this is another problem. Mm -hmm. Here is not about the Quran. The, the, here is about being, let's say, transgress. But everyone, he says to the other one, you are the one who transgress. This is why there are groups. <laughs> you know. So now every group want to kill the other group. The Shia, they, they are many many uh, sect, and they want to kill each other too. Sunni, they are killing each other, but and the Sunni want to kill the Shia, and the Shia want to kill the Sunni, and they want to kill the Druze, and the Druze. It's a, so the Muhammad he established the self destruction rule of Islam. This is why since Muhammad he died until now, Muslims they never have peace together because of this verse. This is a priceless verse made by the devil to destroy his kingdom. Chapter 49, verse number 9. And it is the reason to justify killing of each other. That's why Muslims will never be united. Muslims will never have peace. And Muslims will never be a one state. Never. Because of this chapter and this verse. The only way to be a one state, if one group of them accomplish victory over all other groups and kill them all. That is the only way, and that is impossible. Well, sounds like the fruits of the devil to me. Well, this is the kingdom of the devil is divided, you know, and uh, I believe that the, the 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 wisdom of God is uh, is uh, you know is uh, what made the devil uh, you know fight himself. Muhammad. I think he never thought that this is, will be the death. Let us say this is the the bullet <laughs> in the head when he said that. It was a big stupid mistake of him to say this verse. And now all the Muslims, like if you go and uh, if you go and see the Shia, why you are fighting Al Qaeda? They will read for you this verse. If you read to the, uh, if you ask the Al Qaeda, why you want to kill Al ISIS? They read this verse. If you ask ISIS why you want to kill a normal Muslim Sunni or Shia, they will read this verse. All of them they read the same verse to justify killing each other. So this is became the law and the method of killing each other to justify the bloodshed. For each one of them believe I am the one who is right, and you are the one who transgress. So and the and the Quran, he gave me the right to kill you. This is why they will never have peace. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, Michael, I think we have. Uh, it for me. It's already five a.m. in the morning here. <laughs> this guy. It's, it's, it's four here. I actually woke up to. I, I'm surprised. Actually, you guys are up. I mean, like for for me, I don't sleep. I mean, my my uh, my day is different. You know, my day is really totally different because I I receive a lot, I have a lot of work to do. But this guy, imagine he posted in Facebook that Christian Prince he blocked me. I mean, what blocked you? Where? <laughs> when? He wouldn't. He wouldn't answer any questions. And nothing was his yeah, concern. Yeah, you know. And this is why I said to myself, let me get him busted, even though it's late. And uh, you know, I mean, uh, but I wasn't expecting that uh, seventy people would be up. But look like you guys are scattered everywhere. You are in the state, right? Yeah, I'm in the uh, Midwest. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, uh, I said okay. Let me let, let let us get this Abdul here. Anyway, but he was Quran only. Is was that the thing? No, no, or? no. He's not. He's not. But he's the kind who will not answer anything. Anyway, <laughs> maybe you should have talked to him like Zach and Mike. Brother, and sister. Yeah, uh, he will not answer anything. That doesn't matter really. Yeah. Thank you, thank well, you, uh, Michael, for calling. God bless you, hey, friend. Th thank you for letting me call. God bless and thank you so much for your work. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. All right, bye bye. All right, all right, guys. Yeah, I actually, uh, I really enjoy talking to you, and I wish one day, like this, the, this brother here, I wish one day we can meet and have some coffee together. Uh, you see, this is the good thing about the internet. You can meet here all kind of people. You can meet wonderful people, and you can meet even evil ones. However, I believe that the fly go to the flowers and now i say the fly i'm not talking about the fly in english i'm talking about in arabic maybe i'm using the wrong word let's say this way the bees go to the flower and the fly go to the garbage so uh, if you are a person from a good quality 
the Lord will, will put in your way good quality people. And I wish one day we can meet those good ones and, you know, sit. And we don't talk about Islam. We don't want to talk about this stupid garbage. I mean, I'm sick of it, seriously. <laughs> like, sit and enjoy talking to those wonderful people like Michael. And, you know, there's many. I don't want to mention names because the rest will get jealous. will say, hey, he, he forgot about me. Wonderful people here. I don't want to mention names. But uh, it will be amazing to meet people who have the same interest and they have the same passionate, uh, the same mission, and you have a good time with them. Like, I wish one day I can take a bunch of you and we go do camping somewhere. Uh, I don't know if you guys, you like hunting. I, I like hunting. So like we take our guns and we go. That would be fantastic. And we will not take women with us. <laughs> Unless they are cowboy. <laughs> uh, uh, it will be really uh, a good time to spend with the good ones one day. And I hope that will come. Uh, <clears throat> who of you like hunting? Who of you here interested in hunting? I know not, not all people, they like uh, killing animals, etc. They think it's wrong. I, I think nothing wrong with that, you know. Uh, you eat every day. You kill it or somebody else kill it. It's the same. You know, even those who say they are vegetarians, I mean, you kill something to live. Still, you are killing a, you know, killing a plant. It's, it's a, you know, it's a plant, it's a life. So, you know, you, you survive by killing. This is how it is. This is how God, he made you. So there is lawful kill and unlawful. We do the lawful one. All right. So I love to uh, hunting or etc. And uh, my hobby is guns. I like guns. Nothing wrong with having guns. People, they say, if you have a gun, you are a bad person. Who says so? That's not true. I have guns all my life. I never I never hurt people. You know, I'm not a criminal. Guns don't, you know, kill. People kill. You can leave the gun in your drawer for, for the coming 100 year. It's not going to shoot anyone. It's people. It's, you know, people, they can kill by a car. They can kill by a knife. Uh so uh, it's a wish. Maybe one day we can get uh, we can get in touch with those guys. Uh, and Michael, we go, me and him, we will take with us who? Who want to go with us? Let us see. Let us invite the ones who they are in the Far East. This way they will never come. The same as Wael Ibrahim, he challenged me to debate him. <laughs> and then after he challenged me to debate him, uh, actually, I challenged him to debate me. And then he said, I agree. And then he said, "Okay, uh, let us do it uh, when you when you want to do it in America next week." I said, "Anytime you want." Now, then he said to me, "Well, I cannot take a visa." <laughs> so this guy is invite me to a debate, but yet he cannot have a visa. Yeah, so let us invite the ones who cannot have a visa. This way, nobody come. <laughs> anyway, oh Lord. God is good, and really, I love you all, and good that we have fun together, and we love, and I hope time will come, and we will meet the good ones of you. Actually, I, I, I there is some people inviting me to go to Europe after July, so I'm not sure if that will happen, uh, but if it happened, if any of you is in Europe, let me know. Maybe we can meet, all right? But you pay for the coffee. You pay for the coffee. <laughs> Just joking. Anyway. Thank you guys for being here. May the Lord bless you. And remember, remember one thing. We are, we are strong for we have him. Not because we have a Christian prince. Christian prince is no one without him. His name is powerful. His name is mercy, but yet it's so powerful. And there's no enemy can take you down as long you are with him. They can kill you. They can take your life. But trust me, the life is given to you. Nobody can take. They can threat us. They can try to intimidate us. They can play all the games of the devil. But we have the one who no devil can overcome. We are victorious by his name, and we are winners by his wisdom. And we are strong. 
by the knowledge and the gifts he provide us so I want every one of you to use the gift of God which he gave to you every one of you have it but the problem is many of us do not recognize what God he gave us he gave you amazing beautiful things in your life some of you have a family have a wife have a children's be good to them that's a gift some of you have an intelligence some of you play music some of you maybe is good in writing every one of you have something good on him use it for his glory when you look at your child remember that God he gave you a gift love your child when you look at your wife remember to be honest and not to cheat and not to lie be good as God he wanted you to be be always in remembrance of the of, of the favor he gave you he gave you a life maybe what is given to you if you don't appreciate will be taken from you tomorrow so you better appreciate appreciation is the key of life to be happy and to be satisfied a person who don't appreciate what God gave him he will never be happy for he's always feeling sad for he is not appreciating appreciate the bread in your table appreciate the food you eat appreciate the family you got appreciate that you have a friend that loves you appreciate them otherwise they will be taken from you and I appreciate the Lord he made me meet with you until I see you soon again may the Lord bless you Christ is Lord and Islam is false and see you soon again bye-bye